Okay, we're here at um, Tippenham Airfield, Norfolk, United Kingdom. Um, this chap standing next to me is Eric Radcliffe. He's the chairman of the Norfolk Dying Club. He would like to um, speak mainly to our American friends about his book and the Castle mission. Okay. Um, we uh, maintain this airfield as a living memorial to the 554 guys who took off from here and never landed. Um, the worst loss by any single group in history was took off from here on the 27th of September 1944. 39 aeroplanes took off, well tried to take off, one never got off the ground, 38 took off. Three uh, aborted and uh, came back to Tibnum, and the 35 that went on to the target, uh, 25 of them were shot down over Germany. Uh, one crashed in Belgium, one, uh, two crashed in France, two managed to stagger back over to over the channel to Manston, which is a, an emergency airfield, and four got back to Tibnum. One the the final ones came staggering in, tried to get in on runway 33 here at Tibnum. He'd got his gear down, his flaps down, he'd lost two engines, um, he was in a high drag situation and he, he found that the 33 runway was actually blocked by uh, other aeroplanes and vehicles. So he couldn't get in, so he staggered on and actually crashed to get just short of the runway at Old Buckingham. Uh, so of the four aeroplanes that got back to Tibnum, uh, one of those uh, ran off the end of the runway because he got no hydraulics. Um, three, uh, the other three, only one aircraft was fit to fly uh, the next day. And it shows the bravery of these guys um, that next day this airfield put up 10 more aeroplanes which they'd baked and borrowed from other bases, plus the one service or aircraft left after the mission, and took off and went back to where their bodies were still lying in smoking wrecks in, in Germany. Uh, of the uh, 118 guys were killed in action on that day, uh, flying out, 117 of them from here and one fighter pilot and 135 wound up as POWs um, and uh, it's the biggest single loss in, uh, in an Eighth Air Force group history. Thank you very much for that Eric, that's a very interesting and um, every year here the Norfolk Gliding Club allow us to come here and we hold what is called a salute to the 445th bomb group with our model aircraft. We always make a point of holding a remembrance ceremony at midday and this year we're fortunate enough to have the, um, the American Honor Guard and we've also had the Spirit of Coach Association with a trumpeter and a piper which is very poignant. Um, speaking to our American friends and all those who stood up for freedom, we give thanks for what you did for us all those years ago and we owe you a debt of gratitude that we can never ever ever possibly repay. So that is what drives me on personally to organise these events here at Tivenham and I'm thankful for Eric and the Norfolk Gliding Club to allow us to do so and hopefully we'll be able to continue to do that. So to our American friends, thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. Eric, um, I saw recently um, that you had a fundraiser page to try and do some work on the runways here. Um, can you tell us anything about that please? Yes, yeah, sure. Um... We uh, had a crowdfunding project called Project Phoenix, which was quite successful. We raised uh, nearly nearly twenty thousand pounds. We the runways here. We we are the largest privately owned airfield in the UK, and the runways here are the asphalt on them is seventy seven years old in in most places, apart from the main runway, which was resurfaced in nineteen fifty five. So that's. Uh, a princely uh, uh, 10 years younger but um, weeds abound and potholes arrive but we try to keep it maintained and run them as a living memorial to, to all those guys uh, who, who flew from from here and never managed to land again um, and 
are still up there somewhere going for a circuit. And uh, it's a constant battle and we're, we're very grateful to the Model Association for the donations that they have made and the members uh, to, to us. Thank you very much. I think that just about sums up. Thank you very much. Thank you.